Hello everyone, welcome to PA Academy. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to draw a given circle when you are given a circle with a given radius to touch two arcs. So if, if you have two arcs, so let's say we have one arc and then we have another arc like this and you are asked to draw a circle with a given radius such that the circle will touch, you know, the two arcs. So you are going to be having something like this. Now this is a freehand sketch. It might look easy, but you need to understand uh, the step on how to go about so that's what i'm going to be covering in this video so before we get into this video if you are here to subscribe to pa academy please click on the subscribe button to subscribe to this channel all right thank you very much if you have just subscribed if you are yet to click on it please click on the subscribe button right now to subscribe to this channel thank you very much if you have just done that so in doing this now you can see that we have two arcs so this is one arc and this is another arc and this is the circle of the given radius so now for this example, let's give the radius that we are going to be using. So now let's take this as our radius. So let's call this arc radius 1. Arc radius. Arc radius 1. So let's call that R1. And let's use a radius of 8 centimeter. So this second arc, let's call that, let's call that arc radius arc radius 2 so let's call that r2 so let's use 10 centimeter then for the circle let's use a circle with radius of so let me write circle radius so let me use small r so let me that's two centimeter so now let's use these three parameters to illustrate this example what you are is to draw a circle to touch of a given radius to touch two arcs. So I don't want to skip any steps, so that's why I'm, I want to show you how I'm going to be drawing drawing the arcs. So let's draw the first arc with a radius of 8 centimeters. So you pick your compass and you measure the 8 centimeter. So as you can see, this is my 8 centimeter. So this is it. So let me note it. So this is the point where we picked the place our compass. So from this point down here. So this is our R1. Our R1 which is 8 centimeter. So let's note that. So now let's go ahead and draw the second arc. That is R2 with a radius of 10 centimeters. So I'll pick my compass again and measure 10 centimeters. So irrespective of the units that you are using, if your unit is different, I mean I mean the length of your radius is different, it's the same step. So this is my 10 centimeter. So let me draw it from this point. Okay, all right. All right. So that means from this point straight to the arc is our 10 centimeter and this is our R2. Our R2 is equal to 10 centimeter. So the next thing is that we are going to be drawing another arc that will give us the center of the circle that we are going to be drawing here. Don't forget we are going to be drawing a circle here with a radius of 2 centimeter such that the circle will touch this arc and to touch this arc. So in order to do that, from this point, so you can start from this point, since the radius here is 10 centimeters, what you are going to do is you are going to add it, this R2 plus R, this small R, that is the radius of the circle. 
So we are going to be adding it together. So in addition of the addition of that will give us so that's 10 plus 2 will give us 12. So we bring back our ruler and our compass and measure 12 centimeters. So that is R2 plus R. So this is 12 centimeter. So from the same points where I drew the R, uh, this R2. So from this same point, I'll draw another arc so you can make it faint. Okay, let me just increase so that you can see it. All right, so so that is it. So let me just indicate the, the radius of this one. So this arc that we've just drawn is R2 plus small r, so that is 12 centimeter. So what we've just done here, we are going to do the same thing here. So that means we are going to be adding R1 plus R, plus that's the radius of the circle that we are going to be drawing here. So that will be 8 centimeter plus 2 centimeter, so that's 10 centimeter. So I want to measure 10 centimeter. Okay. So from this point, so now note their point of intersection. So the point where these two arcs meet, that represents the center of the circle that we are going to be drawing. So let me indicate this. So from this point to this arc is R1 plus R, and that is 10 centimeter. So since we've gotten the center, the center of the circle, So now we measure the 2 cm, which is the radius of the circle that we are asked to draw. So the circle of giving radius of 2 cm. So this is 2 cm. So I'll place it at the point of intersection. And from that point, I'll draw the circle. And here it is, we already have our circle. So you can see we already have a circle with a given radius of two centimeter touching two arcs two arcs where we also have the radius of the arc so this is how you go about when you want to do this type of construction so if you have um, any question concerning this or any other question just leave them in the comment section below um, if you check the description of this video you'll find a link to a similar video something like this a little different in different dimension you know there are different ways to go about it or different ways you might be asked to do something like this so just check the description for more similar videos like this. Uh, if you are yet to subscribe to PA Academy, please click on the subscribe button to subscribe to this channel. If you find this video helpful, give it a like, click on the like button, make sure you share this video. Also check out our playlist on technical drawing for more drawings like, for more you know, different drawings on tech, uh, technical drawing. And you can also visit our website, paacademy.co, paacademy.co. So with that guys, I'll see you all in another video. Thank you very much for watching.